Hi, my name is Jean Black. Today I want to show you how to baste a quilt using hairspray and a few pins. Actually, I won't show the pins, but I'll show you the basic hairspray basting, and then I just anchor it in a few places with pins, not nearly as many as if I were pin basting. It makes it much easier for me to quilt a small quilt. This does not work on a large quilt, but it works great for a small lap size quilt. And actually this, what I will be basting today is half of a quilt because I do my quilts in pieces and join them in a quilt as you go method. So let's move over to the floor where I have the quilt back and the batting laid out and we'll get started. Okay, so here I am in the floor. I have the quilt backing laid on the floor. I have the batting rolled with one piece rolled back over the top. And what I do is usually just lay it down here, make sure that it's going to cover most of the batting, I mean the backing, and then I fold it back up. I take my hairspray and I use Aquanet Extra Super Hold. I spray lightly across here, then pull my batting down and smooth it with my hands. Make sure it's nice and smooth. Then I roll this back onto that piece, spray that side, and roll it as far as I've sprayed, slide my hands under the roll, and smooth everything out. This will give you a nice smooth backing without any wrinkles or puffers. And I just keep going that way. Small sections, roll it, smooth it. And I crawl right onto my quilt top. I don't worry about it too much. I'm going to check it. This will pull apart and you can redo it if you have a problem. Spray, roll, smooth. And I start to the, from the middle and push all the way out to the sides, getting it as smooth as I can. I always like to roll it back toward me just a little ways so that I don't miss any spots. Spray, roll, smooth. Crawl forward. Spray. Roll. Smooth. You'll probably be a little slower than this your first time, simply because it'll be your first time. But it really it goes quite quickly. Spray. Smooth. Let's see. And see, you can tell where it's stuck. Now, just so you can see, I don't normally do this, but I'll pick it up and see, got a little bit of wrinkling here, not much. And I can just use my hand and smooth that right out. Usually that much I wouldn't worry about because it will sort out when you quilt it. The quilting will take up some. The next thing I would do is roll my quilt top and do the same thing I did with it that I did with the batting, spraying the spray onto the batting this time. And that is how I based with hairspray. Thank you.